Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the Gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League, coming right up. It is Nottingham Forest, it might be, and a goal! An early boost for them, the first goal of the game, they're off and running. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Morgan gives White. Kuyate now. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, I think it's a good moment to send it over to Alex Scott because, Alex, I'm getting word there's been a goal at the top. Well, it could be on for him here. And a goal here! There it is! They've done it! Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And what a clinical finish this is. Hit with such power by Sterling. Not much chance for the keeper there. It's a great goal. Now so back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Well, apologies to Alex for having to interrupt her. To clarify, Fulham have scored in that game and they now hold a 1-0 lead. Crossing opportunity. And Thiago Silva knows a thing or two about blocking. Could pull one back here. And he does! He's thrown his team a lifeline. The belief is back. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? N'Golo Conte. Here's Kovacic. An effective challenge. Emmanuel Dennis. Fed through by Kovacic. A glorious chance. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So on with the action, and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. And two here. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Counter-attacking, very much an option. And Sterling has it. On to Pulisic. Sterling! What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing! Drilled home with true conviction! Tremendous goal! Well, as you can see, he gets to the ball first, he uses the right technique, and he finishes it really well. That's a good goal. Well, the action continues, and Chelsea are accelerating away from their opponents, it seems. 
effort was good, but he just gets underneath it. That was a decent effort. And Golo Conte. James. He has teammates around him. Oh, showing excellent vision. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and Mount couldn't hit this any better. What a great finish this is. That's an excellent goal. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Renan Lodi. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. McKenna. Aboniyi. A oh, tremendous vision. Not a great pass. They're making use of his physical... It might be! And a goal to delight the fans! Just what they were hoping for! Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Thiago Silva on to James Pulisic Mateo Kovacic this is Thiago Silva Reese James here's Kovacic can he take the chance a goal and I'll tell you what on this sort of form very few would lay a glove on them well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place, and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. Chelsea goal, number 19, Mason Mount. Oh, he's given us away. Kovacic. The end product just wasn't there. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Nottingham Forest taking on Brighton. Might be able to set up the chance. Is it going to be? And it what they were hoping to produce they've delivered the goal well here it is again and the defending simply isn't good enough they have to react quicker deal with the danger and show more urgency none of which they did and that's the result well you're absolutely right that's a top class save just look how he reacts Remo Freuler on the ball to Organazar can they exploit the space out wide? Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Oh, what an opportunity. There it is! A fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. Torgan Azar. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? Well, space if he goes inside. Spot on with that tackle. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. So the final whistle, and what we can say officially now is that Chelsea have picked up maximum points from this fixture. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display. This is the night both sets of supporters have been waiting for. Not long now until kickoff on match day one in the Champions League. Who will get off to a positive start with all three points? It's Milan.
They take on Chelsea next on EA TV Live. Good evening, everyone. Tonight, we're talking to you from one of the special venues in European football, the San Siro, here in the city of Milan. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Milan taking on Chelsea. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. There's still danger here. And in at the second time of asking. Just what was required. Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. So the game has restarted, and Chelsea are the team with the lead. Coming up here. Can they square the game? Oh, did so well to deny him. So the corner played into the box. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Opportunity. And a goal! An end-to-end -end game. And they weren't behind for long. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end. But his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Sterling. And showing good patience. Well, it's fair to say he's been across all the back pages and the focus of social media as well, leading into this game, playing against his old club, and I wonder what's going through his mind, Stuart. Well, he shouldn't approach this differently to any other game. He's just got to forget the crap. Must score! And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just not able to stay with him, and he's having a field day. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. Yeah. It'll be interesting to see whether or not Chelsea can articulate an appropriate reply. Might be dangerous. And missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that evening. But now we see that the offside flag has gone up. Mateo Kovacic. Nkunku has it. Sterling. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Big chance. A goal. That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Tomori. He's in control of the situation. Rebic. Can they forge ahead? They do! Well, here it is again, and I feel a bit sorry for the goalkeeper. He makes a good save to start with, but where are his defenders following in? Instead, it's the attacker who's alert. He gets to the ball first, and it's a good finish. So the game has been restarted. It's Milan in front here. Leal. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Wesley Fofana. Here's Kovacic. Leal. Now Conte. Determined. Oh. 
useful looking position, you've got to say. And it might be. And a goal to increase their advantage to two overall. That little bit of a cushion. Now it's all about keeping the concentration. Well, here's the goal again. And what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So the current scoreline, 4-2. And I think the threat has been averted. The end of this particular story, and 